Hey everybody, it's Thrasher121 with yet another video. In the previous videos, I've showed you how to build Minotaur with its deadly drum spinner, Beta with its amazing hammer, Bronco with its flipper. I'm going to show you how to build Bite Force. I'm going to show you how to do it in two parts. First off, it's going to be the top, the head, and the arms as I call them, and the base with the treads. Okay, here we are. We have 1x3s on a 1x2 slope. And then you have this. These are very hard to come across. However, if you have Lego Mixels, you can have them. Very easy. I built two of them. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to have a 2x3 blue. Just stack them right on top with the arms, as I call them, hanging over. Then you're going to take a 1x3 with studs and just slap that right on the top. And then you need a 1x3 curved slope. So you got this, and then you need two hinges. Make sure you know, for appearance-wise, that the same color is going in the same direction. And see, this is how it works. It's very simple. I feel like it works amazingly. Now on to I the really like this spot, and I didn't want to take it apart all the way. It's basically a 4x4 four four cir circle plate, which you can find, which ratchets around, and three 1x2s. Then you're going to have another 1x2 with holes in it, and you're going to put Technic pins in them. Then you're going to have these two pieces, I don't know what they're called, put them on, and put this piece on. Then you're going to put some um, side headlight bricks on, I only had white at the time, and some of these arches on. Just slide them on like this, and they don't even have to stick on. Trust me, it'll make sense later. So you're going to have two of these, two both, and this is going to make the appearance of treads. So I'm going to take this hinge brick, I didn't have anything else at the time, slap that right there. These two by threes, put them on, and as you see, it holds them in place. Put this on with the jump plates on the back. And there you go. That's Bite Force for you. All you have to do is make sure you put them on the second stud and you are done. These are just all such amazing little things. You can have them just little things to sit on your desk or you could have them for like free time, wherever, like at work or if you're a kid, anywhere. Just have fun, ram them 